Hello everybody, I'm going to be talking about how GoodNotes 5 um, has been messing up my links and what has been causing it and how to um, avoid the links getting messed up just because I ruined my other planner because I put it on GoodNotes and I started you know, doing what I usually do on GoodNotes 4 and all my links got destroyed. Well not destroyed, but they were just a mess everywhere. And so I uploaded a new planner to my GoodNotes 5 um, this is just a trial planner that way. I don't mind if this one gets messed up just because I don't want to mess any more up so The problem has been that I go to my pages tab over here at the bottom or any other tab that um, I want to get a page from so I go to my pages and then I have all my extra pages in that tab that I get to add anywhere I want so <clears throat> Every time I go to the pages tab, it takes me to the, the blank one that you can also move around. So what I was doing is I was going to my four squares and then I was going to the page that I chose and I was just copying it. I'm still getting the hang of this. Okay, it's select and then I was copying it. I press it and then I copy. And then I just wanted to add that page, that page Let's just say as an example, I wanted to add it on my journal over here. I wanted another blank page, not just a one. So what I was doing is I was pasting that page here. But what I realized was that that page has a link. Every time I press on this tab, it takes me to that blank page. So me trying to get the page that has already a link and put it somewhere else moves the link that way. And that would not happen in GoodNotes 4, so I'm going to show you. I'm gonna go to this tab and I'm going to paste the page that I copied over here. So I'm gonna go to my four squares and I'm going to go to the little arrow and I'm going to put add page after. And then I put paste page. After I paste the page, this is where everything just kind of gets mixed up. So I'm just gonna to go to the front and I'm just gonna show you. So if I wanna to go to my pages tab, it does look like it's right, but it's actually in the wrong spot. The page that I just pasted stayed where I copied that page and pasted the new one. I'm not sure if I'm making myself clear. So basically, any tab that has a link and that you wanna move around somewhere, it's going to change all your links. So now, what do we do about it? So something that can fix your problem, especially for uh, if you create digital planners, or if you already have one, maybe reaching out to the person that you bought the digital planner from and making uh, sure that they can address the problem. I'm gonna show you what you can do to fix it. Let's just get this planner. Um, so, in order for you not to mess around with your links, you just can't move a page that already has a link, which is not that hard if you think about it, for example. January it takes me to the month of January I'm not gonna want to duplicate this page because it's only one monthly view I'm not going to want to move January to December which makes sense so don't move pages that have links basically so now if I go to my pages tab what I did is I created a front cover for extra pages this is the page that has a link obviously I'm not going to want to duplicate this page and put it somewhere else so then you swipe and then you have all your extra pages now, since this page doesn't have a link, I get to get this page, so I'm gonna do it. This page doesn't have a link to it, like a tab or a link. So I'm going to go to select, press on it, and then copy. And now I want to insert this page. GoodNotes 5 is a little laggy. I don't know if it's just me, but it's just been lagging on me a little bit. I, I think GoodNotes 4 was better in some parts in some areas but let's see okay so I already copied the page now I'm going to insert it on my students tab and I want it right before this page which is my student rosters so I'm going to go to the four squares and I'm going to go to the arrow add page after wait did I do it right add page after and then I'm gonna paste the page and there you got it all right close so now I go to my students tab the paste the page that I just pasted is there 
Now if I go to my pages tab, nothing messed up just because I ended up copying a paste. I, I ended up copying a page that didn't have a link. So that is a trick. Now, if you're not able to just, you know, if your planner messes up, I'm not sure how to fix it. What I did really quick is I just put my Wi-Fi off so it didn't like sync to GoodNotes 4 and I deleted GoodNotes 5 and then I was on GoodNotes 4 uh, for a while and then I ended up uploading GoodNotes 5 again and it didn't save the messed up planner. So I hope that works for you. So remember, do not copy and paste pages with links. So what I'm doing now further uh, in my planners is that I am not giving any link um, like something that somebody would like to copy so in, instead of putting the pages right away I'm giving it a cover just because I know you're not going to mess with the cover the cover stays there whatever doesn't have a link which is all of this that's inside that cover you get to copy <clears throat> and paste wherever you'd like so I hope that tutorial fixed uh, uh, helps you understand a little bit more about what's happening in GoodNotes 5. I hope GoodNotes 5 can fix this just because I know a lot of planners are already made and they are already working very good in GoodNotes 4 and I don't think that GoodNotes 5 should be a downgrade. So if you have any questions, leave them down below and I'd be glad to answer them. Bye!